Hey, man, I'm going to show you one of the most iconic vocal chains ever, but at a fraction of the cost. And I'm going to give you an introduction to the brand new Warm Audio WA-1B. Let's get it. Wavy Wang. Vocal chain. Yeah. They ask me what kind of chain is that? $20,000 on my vocal chain. Could have bought a watch, could have bought a ring. That one B leaked and they went insane. Would've thought that WA stood for Wavy Wang. Then I put that 73 up in the mix. Yeah, sounded like I'm about to make a hit. That gold mic, that's a WA 8000. Could've split the grip, but WA saved thousands. I got the same chain as Rick Rubin. Sounded like a billion bucks, call me Mark Cuban. Got the same chain as Rick Rubin. Sounded like a billion bucks, call me Mark Cuban. Same chain as Rick Rubin. Sounded like a billion bucks, Mark Cuban. Same chain as Rick Rubin, sounding like a billion bucks, call me Mark Cuban. What you just heard was a vocal chain sound that usually would cost us over $16,000. But with Warm Audio's recreations, I'm just slightly over $3,000 on this budget. For many pop and hip hop style songs for many years, a classic vocal chain has been to go from the Sony C800 to a Neve 1073 preamp and then a TubeTech CL1B compressor and then to whatever recording software you're gonna use. Well, that vocal chain can be quite expensive and even just hard to get, even if I had the money, C800s are on back order, CL1Bs are on back order, and <laughs> 1073s just cost a lot of money. So I would just be up, up the river without a chance on getting any of this gear. But Warm Audio has made it super easy, affordable, and accessible to get iconic sound that has been proven to work on records for many, many years. Let's start off with a brief history of the TubeTech CL1B. This all tube optical compressor was originally released in 1987 and has been a studio staple ever since. Now, the founder of TubeTech actually wanted to model the LA-2A limiter, which was iconic in studios all the way since the 70s, I think. It was, it was just iconic sound, but it lacked a few features of compressors. So the TubeTech CL1B stepped up the LA-2A design with attack and release settings that we could actually adjust. Using the TubeTech is gonna impart some really buttery compression, even if you were slamming it or using extreme settings. And that's why it's so iconic and useful for pop songs and especially hip hop songs where the vocals can get really aggressive. This new replica of the CL1B, the WA1B from Warm Audio, promises to deliver that same buttery lushness. And man, I can tell you from personal experience, is doing an amazing job at a fraction of the price. You already heard it yourself. The vocal chain that we heard was the Warm Audio WA8000, going into the Warm Audio WA73, and then going into the Warm Audio WA1B, an all Warm Audio vocal chain, and that vocal already sounds like it's mixed and ready to go. The Warm Audio WA-1B is a brand new product that just hit the market, and guess what? It is available for you to purchase on my website. Yeah, wavyproaudio.com is your pro audio plug. All the gear you need, all the software you need, and more products are being added daily. So make sure you shop wavyproaudio.com for the best deals on all your pro audio gear, especially that new Warm Audio WA-1B. Now, let's take a look at the components of my vocal chain. Diamonds, baby, diamonds and gold. <laughs> So this vocal chain kicks off with the Warm Audio WA-8000, which is a beautiful tube condenser microphone that is modeled after the famous Sony C800G. Now, the top end and the bottom end of this microphone just boast incredible clarity and gives you a really big sounding vocal. For my mic pre, I'm using the Warm Audio WA-73. This is a one channel British microphone preamp. 
obviously designed and modeled to replicate the Neve 1073 mic preamp, which is one of the most revered microphone preamps in the world. I've engage this tone setting on here which just i just think it sounds better you have everything that you need on a preamp from phantom power uh, phase inversion and then you got a little tone button that adds a little bit extra character to the mix you also have your mic line switch we even get an insert on here and the instrument activation button that'll activate this instrument input you really just set your levels, your input and output, and then I take the output of the WA-73 and route into this beautiful baby right here. Now, if you've been trying to get a CL-1B, you just can't get your hands on it because they ain't nowhere to be found. <laughs> Nobody has them in stock and the wait times are just ridiculous. But so many people want this compressor because it is so popular it does exactly what the rumors have said man it gives you a super buttery compressed vocal without some of the artifacts and harshness that heavy compression can give you on other units so just as to take a tour around first uh from the left to the right we got an on button and a bypass right we also have a on and off for the power so this is just like a soft bypass keeping it on but bypassing the compression we have our gain right this is going to be our makeup gain we have attack and release settings we have the ratio you got your threshold you have the attack and release um settings here whether you want them to be on fixed fixed manual or manual just like the cl1b so with manual, this means that you have complete control over the attack and release. Fixed means the attack and release will be set kind of like a LA-2A. And then the fixed manual will give you a, um, a fixed attack time, but it give you the ability to adjust that release time. You also get side chain on here, and then you can change what the metering is showing with this knob here, whether you're showing the input meter, compression meter, or the output meter. And you got your meter calibration knob right there which makes it super easy to just make sure you're seeing the right levels on your meters so with such a killer vocal chain it's really easy to get some big amazing vocal sounds the same chain as rick rubin sounding like a billion bucks call me mark cuban <laughs> hence the vocal chain man uh it's really just easy to get some really amazing big vocal sounds now honestly look I've tried out a lot of microphones, a lot of preamps, even a lot of compressors. And I must say, I'm like really blown away today with the sound that I was able to get from this chain. Coming from the WA-8000, the WA-73, and the WA-1B, like honestly, I've never been a huge fan of Warm Audio products, but until I gave them a try. So if you are on the fence about giving Warm Audio products a try, don't be on the fence no more. I'm going to play around and adjust a few settings on this uh, WA-1B so we can hear kind of what some extreme settings would sound like. And uh, yeah, let's let's go from there. All right. The settings that I have now are pretty moderate. Let's go ahead and change that. I'm going to start by turning the ratio all the way up to 10. I'm going to turn the attack to the fastest attack. And let's just turn the the release to the slowest release. It can, It's super, super slow. Um, so I'm getting about, about 10 dB a gain reduction. Let's actually bring the threshold down so we can really slam this thing. And then I'm going to turn the volume, the output back up, uh, so we can hear it. Now I'm going to just go ahead and record some rap so we can hear what it will sound like. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. This is wavy. I'm going crazy. Here we go. This extreme settings. Slamming the needle. Yeah. Twenty thousand dollars on my vocal chain. Could have bought a watch. Could have bought a ring. That one B leaked, then they went insane. What about that WA still for wavy Wayne? Then I put the '73 off in the mix. Sounding like I'm about to make a hit. That gold mic, that's that WA 8000. Could have spent the grip, but WA saved me thousands. Oh man, look, look, for these settings to be as extreme as they are, that sounded really, really good. Like I'm literally slamming the needle on this thing and it still sounds good. Slamming it. All right, now let's adjust the settings a little to be a little bit more moderate, right? So instead of the super fast, let's just go everything 
right up the middle. Here we go. Let's try. Oh, see that sound. That sound pretty big. I'm going to let y'all keep watching that meter so we can see. You can see the amount of gain reduction. We just get a little bit of gain reduction, but that, that definitely sounds big. Make sure we're not too loud. It's too loud, too loud. Yeah, 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 yeah. I bet. Let's hear it. Yeah. Wavy. Uh-huh. Whole industry going crazy. This my vocal chain rap. This my vocal chain rap. Hey, twenty thousand dollars on my vocal chain. Coulda bought a watch, coulda bought a ring. That one be leaked and they went insane. Woulda thought that WA stood for WA. Hey, and I messed up on that verse, but I'm about to put the rest off in a hearse, but uh, sounded like I'm about to make a hit when I put that 1073 up in the mix. I mean that WA 73. You know what I mean? Don't play with me. You can come and check for my sound. I'll pick it up and then I'll put it down. Now I know what you're gonna say. Yo, Wavy, but that's not a real C800. That's not how it sounds exactly. I know that's not a, a real Neve, Wavy. So how can you compare that, right? I'm not trying to compare it, at least not in this video. But the bigger picture is that these tools sound amazing, right? The, the WA-8000, the W... 73 and the WA-1B as a combination, we just heard that and similar sounds, right? The, 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 the items that these were modeled after cost so much more, $10,000 more for that package, right? More than that. But if we can get a similar sound, achieve greatness in our own studios at a fraction of the cost, then I think it's worth checking out. It don't gotta be the same. It gotta be good. I'm Wavy Wayne from wavyproaudio.com. Check it out. If you need any of this gear, <laughs> I'm your pro audio plug. Be dope.